A long time ago, Canada was run by something called government. Historians believe that government is an ancient Canadian word which roughly translates to disappointment. The government was a group of officials chosen by the people to make decisions on their behalf. However, since the best and brightest citizens often wanted nothing to do with government, the people were left with a less than desirable group to choose from. From ancient photographs, we can see that the government would sit around all day discussing various issues and generally accomplishing very little. It's impossible to determine how they could take such a cushy and powerful job and have it collapse on itself. But it is believed that during one of the frequent and fruitless struggles for power, one leader decided that instead of giving up his leadership, he would destroy the entire government instead. Now, you and I realize that this is a stupid and selfish act, but primitive leaders simply lacked the advanced intelligence to understand the consequences of such actions. It's difficult for us to tell exactly when this destruction took place. We only know that it was a long, long time ago. However, since Canada has been functioning perfectly well since its disappearance, one thing seems perfectly clear. This government was a completely and utterly frivolous institution, and we are most certainly better off without it.